Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome to Let's Play Nexomon 1. Now, you might be wondering why I'm starting this Let's Play now with the custom mode on its way. I figured this would be a nice way to sort of um, celebrate Nexomon until the Nexomon Extinction custom mode comes out. And then we can um, sort of stop this playthrough when the custom mode of Nexomon Extinction comes out and then continue it at the end. That way we have lots of Nexomon stuff to do. So anyway, this game is roughly three times shorter than Nexomon Extinction, so depending how long Nexomon Extinction's update takes, we might end up getting through all this, but we'll have to see. Either way, it could always act as some, uh, <laughs> it could always act as some extra episodes I can have, uh, laying around for, uh, for a rainy day, you know? Anyway, uh, let's choose our gender, male, of course. So I've never played the original Nexomon, so I'm excited to finally play part one. Long, long ago. This world once belonged to us, the humans. We were the rulers and masters of this land in this era of prosperity. But then, on one fateful day, everything changed. Dun dun dun. From the high heavens descended an unspeakable evil. A creature, a monster. Omnicron. He proclaimed himself as Omnicron, the king of the Nexamon. This wicked behemoth threatened to engulf our humanity into darkness. With one shattering roar, an eternal war between humans and Nexamon began. Over centuries of violence, humans learned how to tame and befriend the Nexamon and use them to fight against Omnicron himself. Then, in the midst of a dark age, one brave human warrior rose against all odds. And with the help of his Nexamon companions, he defeated Omnicron. Hmm. The war ended, and centuries later, we live in a peaceful world along with our Nexamon friends. For Omnicron's darkness was forever destroyed. Or so you thought. I'm thinking we need a Nexomon prequel now. What? <laughs> oh, there's us. That's actually kind of interesting. I wonder if they'll ever do like a, a Nexomon Zero. Omnicron, this is the end of your journey, champion of mankind. My ascension has been set in motion millennia before you were even born into this petty land. None may overcome Omnicron, the king of Nexomon. The almighty king of Nexomon. On this fateful day, my kind will arise from the ashes of your world. Now be gone. So I guess uh, the... The crazy foreshadowing is a uh, story begins with a young is a Nexomon thing. They did that in the child. second game too. Little does he know, his life is about to change very, very soon. Investigate the mysterious sound downstairs. Okay. Let me get this first. It didn't say what that was. The device is performing marvelously, sir. Marvelously. 
It is most certainly uh, ready for distribution, shall we? I'll be the judge of that. Show it to me now. Absolutely. Please follow me. This guy out here looking like a child of Omnicron. Mother. Oh, did the noise wake you, dear? Oh yeah, you know, you just, you just, you just causing explosions in the middle of the house. Oh, did that wake you? Sorry. It's nothing to be concerned about, for it's merely another test of our latest invention. That reminds me, I believe Ellie has been looking for you, dear. Why don't you go and find her? She probably wants to show you her new toy. How very exciting. Ooh, what kind of toy are we talking about? Found a potion. Can I go downstairs? Is she gonna yell at me? I'm gonna yell at that. Yep. Wait, your father's in, a, in an important meeting. Go f screw yourself, kid. Go explore the world. We don't want you. Stay away from us. You can't take Atlas, he's not yours. That's Atlas. I'm not going anywhere without that robot. Go away. Bullying people in wheelchairs. What the heck, this guy's bad. Come back. I said no. Nice. What, what's your problem, kid? Look, over there, he dropped an Examon container. I bet he stole it, we have to take it back. Hey, it's not yours. How are you so strong? Am I an Examon too, you know? <laughs> Atlas, now's your chance. Yes, Master Ellie, I'm on my way. What's a dumb robot of yours gonna do? <laughs> what? That's OP. Why didn't he do that against, uh, against any of the, the tyrants in Nexomon 2? Quick, we must... Quick. Quick, yeah, because that guy's coming back. Ooh, you got seven starters in this game, eh? I guess there's seven types in this game. There's not, uh... There's not, um... Nine types. Oh, this is, uh... Okay, this... Oh, I know some of these guys. Yeah, yeah, these are the, some of the extinct Nexomon. Like this guy, and this one, for example. Yeah, and this one. Mm. I think I'm gonna go with Fethra. I, I really like this guy. I went with Mineral and Nexomon too. We'll go with Wind this time. Let's do it. He's back. Hey, hey, hey what? Oh, it's a different guy. Forget it. I can do this on my own anyway. You don't stand a chance against my Nexomon. Hey, use the X while you got to fight him. Thanks, Tips. Ooh, they should have kept these. These are nice. This is nice. Yeah, they don't have back sprites in this game. <laughs> oh, it's so it's so different. Okay, let's go uh, bite your opponent, causing great deal of damage. Pain. Cast a bullet made a wind to pierce opponents. Uh, cast a sleeping spell on your opponents. Let's go with. I don't know what type. Oh, he's just normal type. Is that what that is? Okay. Let's build the wind attack. Oh wow, did the next one actually make contact with the heck? That's pretty cool. And bite. Goodbye. Uh, are you kidding me? <laughs> he just passes out. I'm done, boys. That was amazing. No way your first Nexomon battle. 
All right, I should introduce you my latest invention. This is Atlas. Hello there. You're gonna love him. Let me show you what he can do. This guy was definitely a bad guy. Hmm, what do we have here? He's a Nexo Lord. He's definitely a Nexomon. He's probably that one son of Omnicron we haven't seen, because we, we didn't see all of them in, in Nexomon 2, I believe. Uh, the greatest Nexomon tamer in the world, indeed. And you must be, well, I don't think that matters, does it now? Even I cannot keep track of all the weaklings, weaklings around this place. Man, you were just talking to my dad. This is the kind of attitude you got. I'm gonna bust your ass. Is that your Nexomon kid? It does not belong to you, does it? Perhaps you believe you're worthy of using an Exmon? Do you have what it takes to be a true tamer? Come on, kid, show me what you can do. You have the guts to steal from me? Why are you so frightened now? Keep that Nexmon, brat. Let it forever serve as a shameful reminder of how weak you are. Now, out of my way, if you will. Get up, scrub. M y yes, my lord. Poor old kids, pray that. Ah, uh, we don't cross paths. What a nice gentleman. <laughs> uh, what is wrong with him? He's obviously planning something evil. Haven't you noticed anything weird about him? Like making the ground explode? He comes here all the time. It must be related to the secret machine your parents use in this building. Maybe we can follow him? Are you crazy follow that guy? Come on now, this isn't a video game. Hey, this could be important. We should go. I think you're supposed to be the smart character in this story. Oh, we got the self... We got the... We got more uh, self-aware dialogue. This is great. Well, here's a smart idea then. We should get another Nexomon. What? This way we won't have anything to fear while following the Nexolord. I'm sure Atlas can teach her how to capture an Exomon. I guess I owe you one for saving me. <laughs> Alright, follow me when you're ready. Go ahead, you always uh, wanted to learn about Nexomon anyway. We'll catch up to you later, okay? So when's, uh... Let's see. No bicycle? They should have made- Oh, it would have been funny if they had a joke about it being a million dollars. East Parham Town. Parham Town? Wasn't it called Parham City in Nexomon 2? I can't even remember now. Oh, hey, you're finally here. How are you? Ready, my new, ready to get a new friend? Damn straight. Excellent. Come with me. Before we start, you'll need an exotrap. Here, take this. Well, let's see. Next one live virtually anywhere, but they try to hide from tamers like yourself. Uh, okay, see the grass over there? Do you notice something strange about it? Not at all. <laughs> That's right. It's shaking. The next one must be hiding there. If you approach it, the next one will probably defend itself. That's when you will capture it. Go ahead. Approach the shaking grass. Bear on. I don't want to catch this guy. Oh, it's forcing me. I'm not using a golden one. No! It's forcing me. That's a pretty cool animation. Success, you captured Baron. What would you like to do? Kill him. Well done. Hey, I see, I see you finally got two. Things should be easier now. Hmm. The next monster captures a little exhausted from the battle. Does you think? No. No, he's not because I just threw a thing at him. Healing an next one is really simple. Just open up your menu and apply the potions, alright? Okay. Always keep your next one healthy. Remember that 
Most cities have a free healing center that you could use. Are you ready? Because I got a plan. I've lost track of the Nexal Lord, but there is another way to learn about him. There's a powerful tamer called Ivan who lives in Parham Town. He's an overseer. Overseers are great tamers chosen by the next lord himself. You must know something. Parham Town is very close. How about we pay Ivan a visit and ask him about the next lord? Let's go, let's go. It'll be fun to meet a powerful tamer. Be careful out there, alright? I will contact you as soon as I learn more about the next lord, okay? And so, our young heroes embark on a journey to the small town of Parham. They hope to meet Ivan, the overseer of that town. Small who town. Might know something about the mysterious Nexalord. Small town. I'm very interested. Yeah, it's called Parham City in Nexamon Extinction. It was not small. Anything but small. So I am very excited to see how, like, what's changed. Like, like, like oh man, I'm excited now. Hmm, let's see now. I'm not mistaken to reach Ivan's town, it's just a matter of going straight. Do we're gonna try and capture more Nexamon? No. Don't tell me what to do. Okay, let's do this. What do we got? Candy Cub. Bunch of Nexamon I've never seen before. Let's go, bro. See this thing, kid? In ancient times, a legendary hero built a system known as a warp network. He used totems like this to travel and protect the whole uh, world instantly. Unbelievable. Nowadays, totems are useless as nobody knows how to use their former power. Ooh, good. Hmm, what's this thing? There's a very faint aura inside, but I don't think there's anything we can do about it. Oh, we will. I know we will. He found a potion. Does Chick have, like, a flyer for me? Hey, are you a new tamer? Newbies should never wander too far from towns. It's dangerous out here. Let me give you a little something to help you on your travels. Thanks. I guess. Take these coins to Parham Towns and get some supply. Okay. I feel like it'd be kind of interesting to do a... A video, um... Comparing the old world of Nexomon in this game to the world of Nexomon in Nexomon Extinction. Sort of like a, a side. This is cool. They didn't have this in uh, in Nexomon Extinction. The trainer faces like that? That's cool. I like it. I don't know. I think that'd be a pretty cool uh, sort of video. Yeah, I, I, I think that'd be pretty cool. Like, like, you know, this is what the areas used to look like, and this is what they look like now. I'm probably gonna do something like that. Another good thing about um, me doing this Let's Play before the custom mode comes out is if I do end up finishing this, um, even if not all the episodes come out, but if I do, like, like before the custom mode, but even if I do finish it myself, like, internally, once we're done the custom mode and stuff like that, I'll have way more video topics because I, I, I wanted to do a lot more lore stuff, but I need to play the first game so I know everything, right? That sucks. Whoa, what's going on here? The rumors of a very dangerous team are causing trouble everywhere. Oh, don't be afraid. What are the chances we'll ever run into one of them? Zero. No, nada, right? We're definitely gonna run them. Found an anti-burn right, right next to the fire. It appears a powerful tamer decided to burn up this area. We don't have many leads, but he can't be that far. How horrible that Nice. Shh, 
quiet, zip, don't you dare interrupt great grandmaster Deriso. Only with utter silence may I perfectly capture nature's beauty in my canvas. Yeah, yeah, no, seriously, go wake it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stand in front of here. It's painting. Nexotrap. I believe this game takes place a thousand years before the la the next Nexomon. Is this Parham Town? Oh my god, it's so different! You know that each region in the world is ruled by a different overseer? Ivan is one of them, he lives in this town, so our chance to learn more about the Nexo Lord. Okay. Before we look for him, you should visit this building. It's a healing center. I'm sure you'll capture lots of next. Shut up. Don't tell me what to do, Alice. After you're done with the healing center, we should go for a shop. We gotta check out this town. It's it's very different. Oh my god, it's so much smaller. It, it doesn't even have the same layout at all. At least to my knowledge, it doesn't look like it does. It doesn't seem to. I could be wrong. Like, like I'm curious to uh, compare them side by side. Very different. Anti paralyzes a gym here. The Great Ivan's Gym. Oh, okay. I guess I went in the right direction. Uh, let's heal up first. We gotta heal that starter of ours. I don't know if we're gonna end up in a battle. Overseer I Ivan is the strongest in the world. But if you work hard enough, you might someday be the second strongest. Yeah, it's so crazy how, how different it is. It's cool, I like that. I like stuff like this. I got you, buddy. I don't need your help. male person again only curious oh she's like a tips person oh, okay never talk to her again then oh my god is a cat still still running a shop or, or was didn't it used to be a dog or wasn't it a dog in next someone it was oh this is the this is the cat we save in next someone too from the when it's a ghost Revive, max revive, elixir, next traps. How many, how much money do we have? Okay. Ow. Thanks, dude. Oh yeah, look at this mu nothing, nothing but muscle up here. Th this is a little uncomfortable. According to my database, Ivan is a bodybuilder, and this is his gym. Hmm, what is this pair of weaklings doing in my gym? And hey, me, the overseer? Why, that's me, Ivan. Remember that. What does a small fry want with the strongest overseer in the whole galaxy? We want to ask you about the Nexo Lord. The, the Nexo Lord? D don't you watch the news? The Nexo Lord is the most powerful tamer in the whole universe. What else is there to know? We know that he's planning to do something shady, and if you have one bit of honor, you should tell us. This music's kind of fire. <laughs> ha ha ha! A weakling like yourself would never understand the designs of the mighty Nexo Lord. Just so we could learn about him, you will have to prove to me that you're worthy. I don't like where this is going. With the Nexomon battle! Haha, you are wise to be afraid of the mighty Ivan. Hey, come on, we came all the way here. We can't disappoint Ellie now. I know you can do it. You can be this dumb muscle head. I, I'm still here, you know. 
Hehe, <laughs> come to me when you're ready, Ruffy. Okay. Is Rookie ready to challenge me? Hells yeah. The great Ivan grants you do. If you win, I'll tell you all about the next Lord. Ha ha ha. I like these trainer things. This is awesome. Ooh, he's thick. Ah, oh, let's put him to bed. No! Thunder? Rude. I'm gonna get my ass kicked. I'm way too underleveled. What the heck? I should have done some battling. Sometimes you can't just muscle your way through, you know? Uh, let's go Panda Cub. Tackle your opponents using your next one's body. Scratch your opponents. Uh, okay, 35, 40. Okay, 40. Sometimes you just gotta get a little thick with it, you know? <laughs> bye bye! Yay! Okay. I can finish him off with my thick wind type guy. You got this, buddy. Yeah. Hey. I didn't even. I didn't even get to use my attack. What? What? Isn't that kind of like the glitch that was that was uh, in the in extinction? I remember there was a glitch that no no that that was if you died they get to keep to keep attacking. Interesting. I don't know if that's an intended mechanic or just a, another mistake, but uh, I'm gonna go off and do some training I think for the rest of this episode or some more exploring at least. There've been some really strange earthquakes lately. You know I think it must be related to the excavation in the Solus Desert. They're digging some Solus. Hey, Solus is the name of the next one <laughs> from extinction. They're digging something huge and powerful, even we can feel it this far away. Hey, you know what? I don't think this is the right way to go. We're looking for the town's overseer. Hey! Don't tell me what to do, Atlas, you little slut. Look at this filth. This is why I hate Naxmon. My kids are tamers just like you, and they'll let those dirty creatures around my house all the time. Okay, let me just steal your stuff real quick. Thank you. Thank you very much. In typical Ed fashion, we've lost our first major battle, but that's all good because I was too busy exploring. So let's uh, let's, let's fight a couple Nexomon and then call her a day. I'm not going to keep these episodes as long as my other episodes uh, of Extinction because I believe this game is shorter, uh, but you guys can always let me know how long you want the episodes to be. Uh, let's, let's train up a little bit. Perhaps being bi uh, higher than level 6 might help. Well, you think that's a strong attack? Come on. What you got, son? No, I pressed A too quick. I didn't even see how much XP I got. It's all good. Oh, another one. Alpoca. I'm gonna make it a point to catch stuff that's uh, more rare, as opposed to stuff that's just whatever. Like, I'm gonna try to catch some good stuff. We need some rares and some ultra rares, because those tend to be the more powerful next one anyway. It's almost like no point in catching commons, you're not gonna use them. Hey, I forgot about this.
You found an antifreeze, yay! Mega rare? Let's go. This is what I'm talking about. Ooh, okay. Now we're gonna catch it. This is what I'm talking about right here. Mega rare. Let's go. Get in the trap, you little hoe. Oh, you mega rares are thick, eh? What do you think this is? You can just waltz in here, cause trouble, not be caught. I don't know what you think this is. I don't, I, I don't know what, you're, what you think you're gonna get out of this relationship from being like this, but stay in the trap. Perfect. Okay, so that's definitely one we're gonna train. Sweet. What we got next? Ugh, look at this common. Trash! I think I'll get Fethra to like level 10. Probably not on screen, I'll probably do it off screen. Probably get like Fethra to level 10, and then I'll get uh, the other, the Mega Rare to level 10 as well. And then we'll just sweep everybody. I think that's what we're gonna do. Oh, here we go, we got a battle. Wanna fight, bro? Well, look at that, a target for my new Nexomon. Hehe, <laughs> I'm on a win streak today. I'm about to screw up your win streak, buddy. Some aspects about this game, um, like, okay, when Extinction uh, launched, they didn't have that thing that tells you the rarity. Like, some aspects of this game uh, actually feel more updated than Extinction was at its launch, so I'm, I'm very happy with it so far, to be honest. Uh, a powerful set of turbulent currents that cause a great amount of damage. Okay, let's go. I feel like this game needs a console release, like Extinction got. Like, just but you, Oh, you know what would be awesome? Okay, this is an idea. This is a cool idea. Let me know what you guys think about this. Imagine um, Nexomon Collection. So when Nexomon 3 comes out, um, maybe they could, I don't know if they do it with, with a brand new game, but uh, okay, let's pretend no Nexomon 3 or whatever. Or maybe when it comes out, they could have like a separate release or a, or like a, or like a player's choice edition or something that has like Nexomon 1, Nexomon 2, and Nexomon 3 on um, like next gen consoles. So Nexomon Extinction came out for PS4. But it'd be cool if they had a collection that had an Xmon 1 and, or even just 1 and 2 on PS5. That'd be pretty cool. Or uh, Xbox, whatever the new one's called. Series X. I don't know, I just think that'd be kind of cool. Like a, whoops. Why well, I pressed A pretty quick. Like a Nexomon collection or something. And then like, they could do a remaster or they could even like up update it to have like back sprites and all that stuff. That'd be kind of cool too. I don't know, Nexomon devs, if you're watching, which you're probably not. Nexomon collection. Make it a thing. I'd be down. I kind of like how quick you can you can start attacking. <laughs> hey, some aspects of this game that I really like. Uh, in contrast. Okay, let's, uh... Let's up on, oh, that's the bag. So then this, that's the, the team. Let's throw, oh, Felicius is very low on health here. There was a healing, uh, I could just go back to the city. Okay, we'll do a couple battles with Felicius and then uh, we'll call it a day. Uh, like I said, I want to keep these episodes a little bit shorter than the Extinction ones. But when I heard that Extinction was three times longer, I'm a little skeptical. It's that much longer. I'm not, I, I don't think the game's that short. Like, the, like, I could be wrong. But next one, Extinction took, what, like 30 to 40 hours to beat? Is this game, game gonna only take like eight to 10? Possible. But uh, we'll see, I guess.
What you got? What you got? What you got? Ooh, another Felicius. Okay, uh, a powerful headbutt that confuses your opponent. What's the accuracy? 40? Inflict damage. Okay, uh... Let's go with the kick. 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 Oh, hit me with headbutt. Kick. Falcon. Kick. Hey. Nice, that actually hit. <laughs> yeah, get confused, son. Like I said, I'll train a little. I'll, I'll train a little more off screen. Wow, that for forty percent accuracy is pretty good. Or is it, is it the confusion has 40%? Or am I just getting really lucky? I feel like it's just me getting really lucky. I feel like with a 40% accuracy attack, uh, confusion should hit like every time. Okay, one more fight, we'll uh, give him to level five and then we'll call it a day. Uh, I, I do hope you guys uh, are like looking forward to me playing this game as well as the custom mode update as well. Uh, I know we just, did just finish Monster Sanctuary, so I've been finding a our next uh, target to play. <laughs> but I figure with next month's update coming, this just makes sense. Uh, at least until then. So there we go, level five. Ooh, fo uh, energy blast. Uh, a cast focused cast a focused blast of energy on your opponent to gr deal great damage. Good to know. So yeah, guys, let's figure out how to save. This is how you save. Yes. All right, guys. Well, again, I do appreciate you watching, and I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure to let me know, and let me, uh, make sure to let me know if you want me to make these episodes longer, shorter, whatever. Anyways, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.